Trades coming to you live from Reservation Somewhere, taking a look at ALCX and a few other coins to uh, continue the night. ALCX coming at 34.72, amazing price action. Are we going to see some more price action? That just remains to be seen. You know, I heard the term uh, dead cat bounce come up a few times in the last uh, 12 hours, and uh, you know, people out here still look still out here looking for some more price action. I've heard a few people talking about you know, BTC to 10,000. You know, is that price action on the table? It definitely, you know, it definitely could be possibilities. You know, I've heard it. I've heard heard some talk about that for quite a few months now, and uh, you know, I've heard that term black swan <laughs> a few times too. I had a couple of people comment that uh, <laughs> on the videos a few times this year, and uh, you know, I've definitely uh, had my eyes on that area as well. But you know, for everybody that's followed the, uh, the the channel for quite some time now, we've been looking for this lower price action since you know right around November. So <laughs> it's been quite some time now. And it's playing out just the way it was supposed to. So we got ALCX coming at thirty-four seventy-two. You know, everybody called me crazy when I was calling that thirty-four dollars. <laughs> when I was looking for that twenty-one to thirty dollars, and uh, here we are. We definitely got that price action. Got a little bit of that creepy crawly action going on. Could possibly, you know, when I see it starting to set up like this in this scenario here, I definitely start looking for some capitulation down to some lower price action. But you know. I, I'm still out here looking for that lower price action, especially if BTC starts getting some more dippy action, which is uh, definitely on the table. We got people calling for some bullish moves to the upside, but you know, with all the news that's going on today, I don't, you know, definitely could possibly just be seeing some sideways action until the market starts making some movement to the upside. We got Russia, Ukraine going on right now. We got a uh, talk of COVID, so <laughs> you know that's definitely affecting the market right now, and uh, you know. Right now we got ALCX coming at 34.57. So as far as making its movement to the upside, we definitely gotta get back over that 49.11, make our way up to the 76 at 67.47, and start making some moves to the upside. So that would be the awesome, amazing bullish scenario with BTC being so undecided. Could possibly just see some sideways action to the market, start some seeing some movement to the upside. And uh, I'm out here lurking for some <laughs> lower price action. You know, is it gonna happen? Just remains to be seen. I definitely got it out there as far as wishful thinking. You know, always got to have that wishful thinking for that lower price action, that more being for your buck. So, you know, we'll do a follow up video tomorrow and see where we're at. So, everybody in ELCX, good luck. Moving on up to LCX. LCX coming out at 0 0.0705. A little bit of love going on. Got that same kind of action going up. A little bit creepy crawly to the upside. Is it going to make some movement to the upside? Just remains to be seen. <laughs> Could come back down and test that support at 0.0391. Definitely looks like, you know, when I start seeing it set up like this, I definitely look for that retest back down to that lower price action. You, uh, you know, looking at BTC as well. It's got that same setup as well. And, you know, it's got to come back down and test that support. So, <laughs> Got to keep definitely got to keep keep my eye on that point uh, three nine one. So you know we got to keep an eye on that support there. If it comes back down and test that support, and if we do lose that support, we're definitely going to be in that how low can you go scenario. So we got to keep an eye on that <laughs> that outlook there. Could possibly just see some sideways action until BTC starts making this movement to the upside. So you know this scenario could possibly be just be sent up here. But as far as making this movement to the upside, we definitely got to get back over that point oh nine four four grab some support and consolidation. Make our way up to the seven eight six at point one one three five and start making some movement to the upside. So that would be the awesome, amazing bullish scenario with BTC being so undecided, getting a little bit, bit of dippy action and so much news in the market today that, you know, it's definitely affecting the price action. You know, could possibly just be seeing the sideways action until the market starts making some movement to the upside. So keep an eye on that price action. And, you know, you always got to remember this is not financial advice. It's reviews and opinions on the market only. And you always got to do what's right for you. So everybody in LCX, good luck. Moving on to XLM. XLM is coming out point one. 399 amazing price section same setup got that creepy crawly action to the upside i still got my eyes on that lower price action i you know put that 0 0.0662 out there for wishful thinking but you know is it going to be setting up <laughs> it just remains to be seen you know it's got some you know decent put in almost a higher high and put in the higher low could you know definitely be setting up with some side action until the market starts making some movement to the upside. As far as getting some bullish movement and decent recovery, we got to get back over that 0 0.01703, make our way up to the 786 at 0.1843 and start making some movement to the upside. So, you know, that would be the awesome, amazing bullish scenario with BTC being so undecided. Could possibly just see some sideways 
reaction to the market starts making some movement to the upside. We definitely got to keep it on that 0 0.1307. We're coming at 0.1398 just above it. So <laughs> is it on the table? You know, could possibly come back down and retest that support. And if we lose that support, definitely come could come back down to some lower price action. So keep an eye on the price action. XLM coming at an amazing price action at 0.1399. So we'll do a follow-up video tomorrow and see where we're at. So everybody in XLM, good luck. Moving on to NKN. NKN coming at 0.0959. Same scenario. Gets that creepy crawly action up to the upside. What's it going to do? Everybody's wondering. So, you know, definitely got to keep an eye on this price action. Keep an eye on BTC. As far as getting some bullish action to the upside, we definitely got to get back over that uh, 0.17 even <laughs> start making some movement to the upside. And as far as getting some uh, extremely bullish action and decent recovery, we got to get back up to that 786, that 0 0.2100 and start making some movement to the upside. So keep an eye on that price action. That would be the awesome, amazing bullish scenario with BTC being so undecided, possibly setting up for some dippy action. We definitely got to keep an eye on that lower price action, keep an eye on that support at 0.0546. So, uh, you know, definitely keep an eye on that scenario. Could possibly just see some sideways action until the market starts making some movement to the upside. So, you know, keep an eye on the price action, keep an eye on BTC, keep an eye on the news. And for everybody and all the coins we talked about tonight, good luck. And you always got to remember this is not financial advice. These are my views and opinions on the market only. And you always got to do what's right for you. So you guys have a good afternoon, good evening, good morning, good night. Mr. Big Braids is signing out.